Welcome to the Windows and Computer channel and I'm going to talk a little bit about something that uh, a lot of users have been um, asking me in the past um, week or a few days basically. So uh, there's been that um, I don't see 21H1 for a lot of people that have um, you know they're on 20H2 or even version 2004 and they were kind of worried, you know, I don't see 21H1. I click Windows Update, it says there's nothing new. Uh, and also, I did post a video uh, expressing the fact that this week, version 2004 is starting to be forced upgrade to 21H1 for people still on the May 2020 update. And some of you are saying, well, I don't see it. I checked and nothing is appearing. So here's the, the, the thing that's happening for two for, for you guys not seeing 21H1. First of all, for, 20, for the version 2004, be patient. It will probably show up at some point. Um, it is possible you might have a little something that's not yet checked. So what's happening, Microsoft is actually training its AI, its artificial intelligence telemetry, to identify which machines can and which machines cannot get 21H1 for some reason. And because of that, what happens is that it's not probably not completed that yet. It knows a certain number of machines are ready and you guys are seeing 21H1. And for that, all you need to do is go into your settings, go into update and security. And here you will see something when you check for updates that's going to be called the um, optional 21H1 feature update, blah, blah, blah. Uh, for those on 20H2, it's optional. It's going to be in a separate section where it's going to say you can click the download and install button. For those on the version 2004, you will be pushed to it. There's no optional update. They want you to move on. So like I said, uh, multiple things, but mostly, mainly, I would say at this point is that Microsoft hasn't yet uh, totally verified all the p uh, parameters, all the telemetry correctly to make sure that every machine is going to see it. Think of the fact that you don't see it as a security uh, f for you because it lowers the chances that an update might create a problem. But when they know that it's fine, it's going to be pushed. So don't worry, not everybody's seeing it. Yeah, you're not alone. Um, you know, it's easy once again to feel, well, I'm alone. It seems everybody's getting 21H1 and I don't see it. Well, it's pretty much the other way around. The majority of people are probably not seeing it yet. And it's slowly showing up. And it's kind of the way Microsoft is using to just be careful not to mess up PCs, basically. So don't worry, it's, it's going to be there. It's going to be there at some point. Uh, you just have to be patient. And at some point, it's going to be uh, showing up when you do your Windows updates. Um, you know, there's no big rush still. If you're on version 2004, your version is still good until about November. You still got a few months left. It's not a big urgent urgency. There's not really that much in features when you jump from, you know, version 2004 to 21H1. There's a few little things, but not that much and uh if you're on 20h2 you have almost nothing to see in the update so you know it's it's not uh, a big deal as long as you update when time comes and that you have it available uh just you know relax it's going to be there at some point if you enjoy my videos please subscribe give us thumbs up thank you for watching